All right guys, so it's currently Tuesday night and so basically I completed most of my exams last week and tomorrow, Wednesday, I have my last and final exam which is in psychology and this is probably my worst subject yet because it's basically like just memorizing a bunch of terms which I'm not really good at so yeah we're gonna just keep studying and then on Thursday two days after today we finally get to go back home I've been thinking about going back home for so long now it's just I've just been counting down the days like literally so yeah studying right now today workouts and that's basically it so uh yeah <laughs> Yes guys, I just finished my last final exam. Finally, I can breathe again. I feel super relieved and then tomorrow we finally get to go back home. You guys see all of these flashcards? Yeah, that's a lot. We are basically gonna throw these all away right now because I will never, ever, ever need them again in my life. Here we go. See ya. Guys, you have no idea how relieved I feel right now. Literally for the past like two weeks, I've just been studying non-stop. Oh, just finished the last workout of the year at university. It was a solid workout. I finally hit 315 for reps on the deadlift, which I'm super happy about. It's been a pretty big milestone I've been wanting to reach for a while now. And uh, yeah, over these past couple of, I guess, days even, I've actually made like some solid gains. So I went from a 225 squat doing a 5x5, five five, literally five days later doing a 5x8 on the squat using 225 pounds which is freaking crazy to me and it felt like butter like it felt so easy and i have no idea where it came from i ate the exact same food my sleeping was the same everything was the same i just rested five days and i came in like flying it was crazy then bench press i mean nothing crazy just steadily progressing from there so uh yeah all right guys, post-workout, you already know, stir fry, but that is not important right now. What is important is that I'm enjoying this Diet Coke. Ooh, that's pretty good. I've been saving this can for probably like over a month now, because if you watched a video where I talked about Monster Energies, which you can watch right up here, right up here, right up here, and it's basically like, I walked out of my room, and then outside of my room is like a big uh, vending machine with a lot of drinks, and randomly one morning, I don't know why or how this happened, but there was a bunch of drinks just literally laying right outside of the floor and I was like, I gotta capitalize on this. So I literally, I grabbed my backpack and I took as many drinks as I could. I grabbed those two monsters and I grabbed one of these and I couldn't really find the perfect timing to drink this because like, they're not, diet drinks aren't bad for you like at all. Everything in moderation is okay, but I just, I'd rather just drink water to be honest, but I thought today is a Big occasion, I'm done with finals, I feel relieved, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna enjoy this coke, I'm gonna just relax now, I'm gonna pack later on, and then we go back home tomorrow, I'll see you guys there. Alright guys, so the time is currently 6am, and I'm currently on my way to the LRT, or I guess it's a bus station, and yeah, basically that's gonna take me to another station where I'll take a bus, and then from there, I'll take the bus to the airport, so it's gonna be like probably like a two hour journey. So yeah, honestly not ideal because I know I could be taking an Uber there, which only take me like 30 minutes. But since I like saving my money, I'd rather just save money and just do it the long way. So yeah, currently heading there and uh, yeah, let's go.
so as you can see I just made it to the airport and it took me actually a lot quicker than I expected. It only took me about an hour so I kind of mismanaged my time so I have about four hours now into my flight so I'm gonna have to wait and just chill and do nothing but uh yeah. <laughs> All right, so I just found out that my flight got delayed for another hour, so I already showed up four hours before my flight, and now I gotta wait another extra hour, so not ideal, but I'm gonna edit this video right now, and then probably eat something later on, so uh, yeah. Just made it back home. Let's go find our dog. Hey! Come here, come here. Take away something and shake. Shake? Good girl. Other hand? Other hand? Good girl, Koda. Such a good girl. Koda, look. 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 Oh, wow. That was cool. Okay, guys. So I just made it back home, finally. So. Before I actually begin to unbox this, I first want to say, give you guys some context of what this actually is. So, on November 29th, I believe, which was Black Friday for Alpha Elite, Christian Guzman, he put a post on Instagram, basically giving away... Can you look at me? Yeah. Just keep the camera on me. Like, no, this is not important right now. Okay, so Christian Guzman put a post on Instagram, basically giving away four $500 gift cards gift cards to Alphalead and so all I literally had to do was just comment down in his comments like a wolf emoji which was super simple so yeah I managed to win which again I'm super happy about and uh, yeah basically I shipped the entire package to my parents house so I thought it'd just be easier for just just to get here I finally get to unbox this so uh, yeah without any further ado let's actually get into unboxing this so I got my scissors right here I've been waiting for this for so long guys you guys have no idea Essentially, I don't really remember what I ordered exactly. All I know is that I spent $500 worth of clothes. So, I mean, just thinking about that, that is a lot of clothes. So I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna dig in. Okay, so here we go. Okay, before we begin, I just wanna say, wow, look at this packaging, guys. I mean, first you get the Alphalete logo right here. I really like this. It says, an Alphalete is an individual who inspires others to dream more, learn more, and be more. So. I mean, that is, I mean, first initial thoughts about this, that is quality. Just have a look at this, like, I just want to see how much this actually is. I'm just going to count how many items I bought. Okay, guys, so 18 items, so I'm going to unbox this, and then give you guys kind of like a breakdown of what it is, and like just the quality and stuff, and give you guys some outfits, like outfit ideas, and then just basically my initial thoughts on this, because this is my first ever time ordering anything from Alphalead. I usually don't order anything from them, because... They tend to be pretty expensive, especially because they're an American-based company, and I live all the way in Canada, and like the currency between the two dollars is like, the American dollar is a lot stronger than the, than the Canadian. So yeah, I don't really buy anything from them. But guys, if someone gives you $500 to spend on clothes, you, you do it. Like, you don't spend half of it, you spend every single penny of it. Like, no questions asked. It was at this moment he knew. He fucked up. Basically, I'm gonna unbox this. Put it on me, show you guys what it is. Yeah, let's get into it. So I'm just gonna quickly change, put on like a different outfit, and then you can, I'll show you guys. Oh, also, funny story. So on my way to the, or I guess at the airport, I only had like, my backpack was like too full to bring with me on like a carry-on. So basically I had to wear like three different layers on me because all these clothes did not fit in my backpack. So I was like super hot at the airport, had to wear all these clothes, but yeah, I'm gonna take these off. I'm gonna wear new outfit stuff. So these are the joggers. And guys, you can't feel this right now, but I can. And this feels soft. I mean, you can literally like sleep on this. It's so soft. It might take a while, so we might do like a little, quick little time lapse. Oh my God, guys. This color blue, it's so nice. Like it really stands out. And I really like this, like, what's it called? Logo or like graphic. Like it's like really stands out. It's not like printed in. It's like kind of like, like it's popping, if that makes sense. So yeah, really good. Really nice quality. Another hoodie. I actually like this a lot. I'm gonna actually show you guys this. So I don't know if you can tell, but this is ha actually has like a camo kind of background. So it's like, yeah, like black, gray. Then obviously you got the logo right here. So 
looks super super clean oh you guessed it another hoodie these guys i'm gonna be warm for the winter where are my scissors where do i put them here we go okay so i don't think i've ever owned this many clothes at once because usually like i'm not really like big into clothes all throughout high school i wore the same shirt every single day alternate between wearing jeans and sweatpants so again if life gives you free clothes you, you take them so uh yeah is koda still watching koda come and box this with me come here koda come here yeah come here koda look at this look at this koda look at the quality koda yeah it says do not remove this tag you got it koda you got it koda don't eat these tags don't eat my clothes koda these are super expensive clothes, and I don't want them to get eaten by you. Where did my scissors go? Are you sitting on my scissors, Koda? Yeah, you are. Crazy girl, keep a good eye on her. I don't want her eating any of these clothes. <laughs> Shake, will you promise you don't eat my clothes? Promise, look at me, look at me. Okay, it's on camera, she promised. So, if she eats my clothes, I have evidence that she shook my hand. Not a pair of jogger, these are actually shorts. Yeah, these are shorts. Oh my God, I'm like halfway through. I'm like the slowest unboxer ever. Sorry guys, I will definitely do a time lapse on this because this is definitely taking way too long. Koda, what do you think? Do you think I have enough clothes? Yeah, I think so too, Koda. I think so too. I actually like, honestly, I don't even remember buying any of these. Like I remember buying some of these, but I bought so much that I don't even remember. This, I do not remember ordering at all. I was literally just adding stuff to my cart as fast as I could because during Black Friday, the items go super quickly. So you gotta act super fast. That's basically what I did. Don't even remember ordering half of this stuff, but it's a nice little surprise, I guess. Isn't it, Koda? Yeah, she's just, Chilling on my hoodie, no big deal. It's not like I care or anything. They're not like brand new, $60 worth of hoodies. It's all good, Koda. I've got two more items left, then we can finally try these on. Sorry, mom, it's taking too long. Okay, oh my god. All the clothes are lying right here. And now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna, I'm gonna wear like a shirt, joggers, and maybe a hoodie on top. And then I'm gonna show you guys. So you can stop recording right now while I get changed, and then you can film me again later. This <laughs> is so much. Shorts or joggers first? Shorts. Shorts. Okay. Welche Größe hast du genommen? Small. Okay. I don't know which one to choose between small or medium. Like, because I don't know. Let's see. Turn around. Ooh, sexy, sexy. Okay, got the shorts. She's still pretty comfy. Like they're 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 tight, but not like like super tight where you can't move. Like, yeah, they're they're a good length as well because. I'm the type of guy that doesn't like to wear their shorts over their knees. In my opinion, that looks kind of weird. So I like wearing them like right above your knees. Kind of show up those non-existing quads. You know, you feel me? And that's... Let me take off all these layers first. So, got this athlete stringer. I got this Gymshark one. And got another Gymshark one. So... Uh, oh, you, did, you didn't film? At yeah, all? I did. Oh, you did? Yeah. Well, yeah, you don't have to film. This part. How does it fit? Yeah, I'm a hoe. I'm a, I'm a hoe. Yeah, okay. I guess a lot of these items are like really true to size. So yeah, if you want like a really tight fitting fit, then I recommend going true to size or even smaller. Honestly, if you have like bigger arms, it'll actually like hug your sleeves. And the thing with these two guys, I think if you put these in a dryer, they will probably shrink. So definitely be careful of that. So maybe if you're putting your clothes in a dryer, you should definitely order a size above. But if you're just air drying them or just whatever, then True to size is the way to go. What size is that? Uh, this is small. Small top, small shorts. I don't know why, but for some reason I ordered a medium hoodie because for me guys, I like wearing baggier hoodies. I don't enjoy wearing like super tight hoodies because in my opinion, the point of wearing hoodies is actually to be comfortable and like just to like be comfortable. So yeah, having like a super tight fitted hoodie is not the way to go for me. So I went for a medium, hopefully this will fit the way I want it to. And oh my god guys, this is so soft on the inside. That's crazy. That is crazy guys. Okay, so uh, that fits pretty well, right? Yeah. yeah Turn like... around, let me see your sexy buttocks again. Nice. Okay, come close and let me see the inside. Inside of what? Of the hoodie. Oh yeah, anyway, so like the inside. I don't know what material this is. I'm not like mm. a manufacturer, but it's super soft. Like, you guys have no idea. So definitely, this is this is my favorite hoodie. Like I like the blue as well. It really stands out. I'm gonna take this off, but yeah, 
I, it's a good size. I'm really happy I did not go for a small because I was literally about to order a small. I was like, you know what? I like my hoodies a bit more baggier, so that's what I did. Go to medium instead and fits perfectly in my opinion. So let's try on these next couple of clothes. You can do a time lapse. Yeah, or you, you know what you can also do? Um, you can do like um, transitions. So like you'll move the camera up super fast. And yeah. then you move it down, and then like yeah. I'll have a different outfit. Okay. Or like, I'll jump up. Yeah. What do you want me to do? Do you want me to turn it up? I'll turn it uh, up super yeah. fast. Yeah, yeah. Okay. You don't need to fill these are on. You can definitely squat in these. Uh, these are <laughs> super tight. I should have gone for a medium. I don't know what it is, guys. Okay, so this is a stringer by Alphalete. This is like almost like too big on me, but this is a size medium. So I thought ordering mediums would be like too baggy on me. So I ordered smalls, but these are absolutely tiny. Good for me. Then I can wear it. My mom can wear them, or my little brother, but um, yeah, at least I didn't pay for them, but... Excuse me, your brother isn't that little anymore. Well, he's like, smaller, he's skinnier, but um, maybe I just grew, maybe that's it, but... Like, I can squat in these, no problem, like, these are... I don't even know what the material is, but like, they're super stretchy, and like, I can definitely squat in these. This hoodie, size medium. We just won't put them in the dryer. Is this a size medium? I hope it is. It doesn't say... Oh, okay, it's a size medium. Okay, we're good. Otherwise, I can bear it. No worries. I'll just give all these clothes to my mom. Don't worry, guys. This is like true to size for me. Medium hoodies. So, uh, yeah. Good arm length, I guess. Super comfortable. Like, this is the exact same as the blue one. So, same material, I guess. Same feeling. So, next outfit. I'm gonna jump this time. Ready? Hmm. Yeah, that's good. Right, let me change the pants. How how skinny do my legs look? Like how how weird does it look? <laughs> does it actually look weird? It's funny. Okay. This is a small cutoff as well. With the gym short cutoff, it literally goes like all the way down to here, so like your nipple will slip out super easily. This one not really because it only goes like down to like here. This is a size small and this fits a lot better than those t-shirts. So yeah, I really like this. Let's change the pants. These joggers have the Alpha Lead branding right here. On like the butt part of it back pocket i guess and then that's pretty much it no branding on the hands whatsoever and also the material is also super soft stretchy as well so you can definitely 100 percent squat in these as well oh my god the next outfit another cutoff same one as the other one just in pink or red i guess and these joggers i ordered a small and my mom was laughing at me so <laughs> Sexy. I definitely ordered a size too small. Come Guys, on, turn around again. I honestly thought these pants, like, I thought my legs were skinny, but like, I guess they're kind of long. So, guys, I did, I don't know. I thought wearing gym clothes be a bit more baggier because I'm a pretty skinny guy, but I guess not. Like, I don't know, guys. But okay, why don't we do a survey? Come on, girls. What do you think? Is it too tight? Okay, first of all, I don't think any girls are watching my channel. Oh, oh. Second of all, I vote for you. <laughs> okay, let's just quickly take these off and um, let's hope the shorts fit a bit better. This sizing is so inconsistent. I've literally ordered a small in every single thing. And for some reason, this feels a lot smaller. Like, uh, I don't know what it is. Oh, that's not a good outfit. Uh, brown and brown. I'm gonna do it anyway. Whatever. Okay, shorts. Shorts feel okay. These are small, size small and shorts as well. Okay, first of all, it's not a great outfit. I would never wear brown and brown together, but shorts. Turn around. Okay. Yeah. I mean, they're kind of tight, but like you don't really feel it because they're so like stretchy. So uh, yeah. And then again, the shirt. I don't know what it is. Like for some reason, some of their items are like true to size and then some of them are like extremely tight for whatever reason. I don't know why, but that's just my honest review. So this is a long sleeve shirt, right? And just by feeling this material, I feel like it's going to be super, super tight. And just by holding it like this, I feel like we're in trouble. So Lucky me. Oh my god, I don't think I'll even get this on. Oh Turn. my god. Oh. <laughs> I can't see myself right now. Turn to the side. Yeah. I can't see myself right now. Only my mom and my dog can. But they're probably laughing on the inside. I don't know how stupid this looks. Ah. Uh, Okay, whatever. We got the Dom looking at us. What do you think? Do you think that looks stupid on him? This looks tight. way too tight on me. Too tight? You don't no. think so? No. It does, it does. Yeah? Around the arms, like... Is, isn't it supposed to be tight? Well, it is, but like, this is a small. I yeah. definitely can wear a medium. I don't know, like... You, you don't know if you're gonna like it, you mean? This is just super tight. I normally like wearing the looser clothes. Oh, yeah. I don't like wearing tight clothes, because it's just not my kind of style. Oh, Lucky this is... Lucky us, Dom. Perhaps we can have it then. 
Yeah, yeah it'll look good on look you. Look at though. me now. Yeah, oh you like look at him. He's wearing like oh, for that exact same outfit. I look like an idiot, but for some reason you can rock it. <laughs> so I don't know. I'm rocking with the Rue. We're going for a run. Come on, Rue. I'm, I'm gonna try it in, with the headlight on. And yeah. It's getting a little bit dark. Come yeah. on. Yeah. Oh, you want it in the forest? Yeah. Come oh, on. dumb. Shit. Oh yeah, cool. that's scary, dumb. Okay, that. Yeah, but it, it, gonna... it's the exact same thing, but then like shorts. So you guys the branding here. It says. Learn more, dream more, be more. Extremely tight. Definitely should have gone for mediums in all of these. This is the exact same one as the green one, but then in blue. So I'm not even gonna bother wearing this. I don't wanna embarrass myself even further. But we got two more items. We got a hoodie and another hoodie. So at least I will definitely be wearing these hoodies a lot. Okay guys, this is the other hoodie. I think it's like gray. Is it gray or brown? Yeah. Like these are like brown. So I guess these are like dark gray-ish i don't know but again i really like this this is actually like true to size like i like wearing my hoodies like just as i said again just like free bit a bit oversized and uh yeah last hoodie i'm gonna put on right now and then this is the last hoodie i ordered camo around it i think kata like this one too the way she is looking at me i think that's a sign of like damn Connor, you look good so let's go with that and guys, that is basically the entire Alphalete unboxing slash review. I definitely feel like you should... First of all, okay, if you've never ordered anything from their website before, you should never buy anything in bulk, like buying a lot of orders in the same sizes, because these sizes may be wrong, not true to size, etc, etc. So definitely, if it's your first time, buy something, just buy one single item and see how it fits. If it fits you well, then in their next launch or the next time you want to buy something from them, buy more items if you want to. So. That's my opinion on this, definitely based on my experience from this today. I ordered everything in a size small. Ah, I kind of feel stupid and kind of feel sad right now, but honestly guys, it is it is whatever. I did not pay for any of this, so I guess that's a good thing. So I don't really feel that bad. And I still got some decent clothes that I'll actually wear in the gym. And that's basically it, guys. I've come to the conclusion that I'm gonna give all of these clothes away to my brothers. So yeah, honestly guys, I look like a freaking pedophile wearing these clothes because they were they fit super tight on me so I'm going to be giving them these long sleeve shirts and then these actually I might keep these for myself just in case just in case but I'm going to give them like these long sleeve shirts this cut off and then I don't even think they'll the, my brothers will fit these pants either because they're just that tight and I don't really think they'll want to wear them either because that's not their style either and then this cut off as well so Honestly, I don't know what to do with these pants. I may just f force it for a couple of times and wear it a couple of times, but I don't really know what to do. Um, I'm just gonna leave them there, not gonna wear them, not gonna touch them, just gonna leave them as they are. So these are all the clothes that I'm gonna be not wearing at all. However, when it comes to the hoodies that I'm wearing right now, and then the camo one, the blue one, and this gray one, I really like them. They're super, super comfy. Definitely gonna keep wearing these. And then um, the shorts, honestly, Although they are super tight on me, they're not extremely tight and because they have like this stretchy material, you can definitely squat super comfortably in them, no problems at all. So I'm gonna keep these shorts as well, I like the color on them as well. And then for some reason guys, these are small cutoffs as well, but these just fit a lot better and just a lot bigger on me. So I don't know what it is, but these cutoffs are the ones that I'm gonna keep. So um, yeah, overall guys, I'm gonna keep about half of these, give half the stuff away. And then I guess it's a win-win. My brothers get some clothes, I get some clothes, my mom may potentially get some clothes, my dad. And um, yeah, so I guess this is just a big pre Christmas present to my entire family. So I guess it all works out um, well. Um, yeah. Thank you, Alphalit. Thank you. Yeah, thank you, Alphalit. Thank you for, for sending me all this money. And uh, yeah, I'm gonna end the video right here. I'm gonna do some, what are we gonna do? Zumba later on? Pound. Pound, whatever that is. I guess pounding drums, I guess it's a form of cardio. And then after that, we're gonna hit some legs with my friend later on. So um, yeah, I'm gonna end the video right here, but you'll see me doing other stuff in my next video. So definitely stay tuned. I sincerely hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to go give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Don't be kidding.